Daily devotionals for August 9th. Today's scripture reading will be 1 John 1, verses 5 and 6. This is a message which we have heard from him and declared to you, that God is light and in him is no darkness at all. If we say that we have fellowship with him and walk in darkness, we lie and do not practice the truth. Now that's a powerful passage. God is light. In him, there is no darkness. It's just that simple. He is the light of the world. So, you know, if we're walking with him, I'm combining the two scriptures here. If we're walking with him, then we need to be walking in his light. You know, he is a lamp unto our feet. We should be walking in his light. But um, what does it mean if we're walking in darkness? I believe that is participating or partaking of things of the world that would separate us from the presence of God. And I don't need to go into great details. We know because we have Holy Spirit living in us. If he brings conviction to us of something we're doing, if it's something we're watching on TV or, you know, uh, pornographic things, if there's video games, uh, I don't know, just a lot of things, things we read uh, or different activities. If we're indulging in uh, alcohol or drugs, something like that, all these things we should know because Holy Spirit is convicting us, then we know that is of the darkness and then we can't have the light of the Lord in us and still participate in those things. I want to read out of um, Revelation 21, verse 23. Uh, it's, the city had no need of the sun or of the moon to shine in it, for the glory of God illuminated it. The Lamb is its light. Okay, now we're talking about in heaven, but you know, He is the light there. The Lord took me there. It was amazing the things I saw. And the light, it was so, it was a brilliance of light. It's nothing like we have here on earth. It's a brilliance of light. You didn't need sunlight. You could see clearly, but it's a brilliance of light. He is that light. Um, Revelation 22, 5 says there, and this is heaven, there shall be no night there. They need no lamp nor light of sun, for the Lord gives them light. So, you know, like I said, he is the light of the world. If we are sons and daughters of that light, then we need to be walking in that likeness of his light and not in the darkness of the things of the world. And, and you all know what I'm talking about because we all have... We all live life, and there are things that surround us in this life that we either partake of or we say no to our options, okay? So anyway, till next time, be blessed, and make sure to, um, you know, click on to our YouTube channel, you know, share it with others, and uh, if you like it, you know, click on it, okay? Be blessed till next time.